Hello Stallions! Today we're going to learn how to count objects in different configurations. If your teacher tells you to make count objects in a linear, that means you're going to put them in a line. So we can put them in a line in a row like this. One, two, three, four. You can also count linear in a row that looks like a column. One, two, three, four. If your teacher tells you to make an array, you're going to put them in rows and columns. When we count arrays, it's like we are reading. We're gonna start from left to right and from top to bottom. So watch what I do. One, two, three, Four. Sometimes you might have to count objects that are in a circular. So I always say put your finger at a starting point. Now I'm going to count going around the circle. One, two, three, four, five. I know to stop here because here's my finger, my finish line. If you see objects that are scattered, you can count them two different ways. You can move them one, two, three, four, five. Or if they're scattered, you can remove them and hold them. One, two, three, four, five. 